All right, hippies. So I just got done making a different video, but I kind of wanted to do just a one take for you guys, um, just so I could drop a video tonight. Um, this is Halo. You guys have probably met him before, I think, but I don't think he gets enough love. He is a Orange Dream Sulfur, or a Butter Orange Dream Sulfur. Um, and he's a pretty cool dude. Let's see if you guys can see the colors on him. Are they popping up like they do in real life? The camera doesn't do it justice. Now, it's kind of funny. When he is in shed, he looks purple almost. It's kind of crazy. But he's kind of a shy guy. Um, I talk about it in probably the next video I post that he is very defensive because he got sick for a little while. So we're just kind of working with him, trying to get his weight back up and stuff. But he's a pretty cool dude. He's starting to mellow out a little bit now that he's feeling better. Um, I'm really excited, though. I want to get an Orange Dream Het Clown to breed to him because I think having some Orange Dream Butter Clown someday would be awesome. But, yeah, so that's Halo. He's a cool little dude. I love his pattern. He also has a ringer. Um, he's not Het Pied, but still a cool little ringer. ready. As soon as he notices, he probably will crawl back in there. Put him to the side, and then we'll show you guys Royal. He is our California King Snake. Now, if you come right over here, you guys will see he likes to hide under stuff, and a lot of the time, we have to dig him out of his aspen because he likes to burrow. Now, he has actually bit me before during feeding, and it does not even hurt a little bit. He's always oh, being spicy right now. I love my colubrids. Um, they are just fast. They are not hard at all to get to eat food. And they can be a little spicy sometimes. But they're pretty awesome animals. Now, California king snakes are really cool. Um, they will eat rattlesnakes in the wild. They will grab them by the face and suffocate them while the rattlesnake is thrashing around and trying to get away. That is metal. I think it's pretty metal. Um, I would definitely would not grab a rattlesnake by the face until it's suffocated. I think that's quite scary. They are not immune to rattlesnake venom, but... I think they are, what's the right word for it? They tolerate it a little better than other animals. Um, that's not a pinky, sir, or ma'am. We do not know if he's a male or a female. Um, I think you have to probe king snakes, and I'm just not comfortable doing that yet. I want to get a probing kit and have someone teach me, but we'll get all that figured out in due time. Yeah, just keep back with this dude for a minute. It's kind of cool just being able to hang out with the snakes sometimes and show you guys and talk about them. Um, just give you random facts and stuff. I think they're pretty awesome creatures. But definitely colubrids are... I mean, I could tell you they're one of the cooler family of snakes, but they're... All of them are cool to me. They're all equally badass. If you look at the scales on his head too, I think it's pretty awesome. But he has giant scales on his head. Like those, when he gets big, those are gonna be big. Yeah. 
I'm shying away from the camera. I'll show you that later. See if I can redirect them a little. Oh! It's another weird thing about colubrids. Uh, compared to, like, my ball pythons or my boas, he doesn't really hang on all that much compared to some of them. But he is a pretty cool dude. We are eventually going to be breeding him. Obviously, I need to do more research on probing and things like that and just get better at certain things before we do that because with ball pythons, it's pretty easy. Um, most of the time, the breeder will tell you if it's a male or a female, and even if they don't, um, we have learned how to pop them. But from the research I've done, it says don't pop other snakes like this. So we just like to wait and do it the right way. But go ahead and put his water bowl back. We have to bury the water bowls because yes, even this little guy will knock over his water. He's a crackhead. But that just looks so cool to me. You should get a close up of that one. And the slithers. Just wild. I love their coloring. We also, um, here in Arizona, we have Arizona Mountain King snakes. And those are basically the same thing, but colorful. Very colorful, like a milk snake almost. And I think those ones are pretty awesome too. Eventually I'm gonna have all kinds of stuff. I'm not just gonna have ball pythons or king snakes. I'm gonna have, I mean, I have an iguana already, but in the future I will have rattlesnakes, um, probably if I can, a coral snake, an Arizona coral snake. Um, I wanna work with game and fish if I can do that someday, that would be awesome and breed some insurance colonies for endangered species and things like that. But for now, I'll stick with the pet stuff that I can get and um, stuff that's not going to kill me. So once I get more experience and things like that and I can talk to um, Game and Fish and get all that stuff figured out, then I'll have a lot more species to work with and show you guys and just get to hang out with these animals and I hope that you guys can enjoy them as much as I do. Um, another thing is like breaking people's fears. Um, I know a lot of people who are deathly afraid of snakes, even non-venomous ones, but knowing that they're non-venomous, they don't kill the snakes because just because it's a snake is, it is just, there are better ways around things like that. Like they eat our rats and our mice and they take care of, they're kind of our pest control, honestly. If, if it was legal, I'd let go a bunch of snakes out here to kill all the rats and stuff. You can't do that. Um, I don't think you can do that. Maybe if you relocated or something, but again, I'll probably have to talk to Game and Fish about things like that, but I don't know. I just think it's really cool to hang out with these animals and show you guys about them. Um, I'm really excited to get a lot more and I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Make sure you like, share, subscribe. Peace out.